What's going on stackers? So in this video we're going to be taking a look at my KDP income report for the month of December. Now this is also part of a playlist and if you want to check that out you can click right there in the right hand corner to go through and watch it. Also if you're new here my name's Paddy and every other day I like to bring out videos teaching you how to make money with nothing more than your internet connection and your laptop. So go hit subscribe and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified for any further videos. Also, if you're serious about low and no content book publishing, then check out that link in the description below to go to the LCB Vault. Within here, I add brand new trainings every single week on everything I'm doing to increase my royalties. You can also get there by going to the lcbvault.com. So, like I said, this video is part of a playlist, so don't forget to go and check that out if you want to see all of my month's KDP incomes broken down. So this video is for December. December was absolutely crazy for me, and it was my best month with publishing to date, and we're about to get into that. So last month was November, where I did, well not last month, <laughs> Last, the last video in this series was November, where I did 3,800. So let's go here to December so we can see how much I actually earned. So as you can see, it was a crazy month for me, my best month ever. And I did $8,720.34. Now, not all of this is profit. I was running ads as well on a few of my books. So nearer the end of the video, we're going to look at my ad spend and deduct that from my royalties to see what my real profit was. Now, I'm just going to refresh the page so that can load up like that because I know there's a few people out there uh, who are a little bit funny with things like that. So there we go, that's $8,720. At the time of making this money, I did have around 3,000 books published. And as we can see, my earnings for the month were pretty good. So the 1st of December was over $286. And then my lowest bit here was $250. My second highest, $534 in one day. And then my best day was December the 18th where I made $584, and then you can see that come after the 18th, sales slowly dropped off because obviously people weren't buying as many gifts. See, that's the thing. I had been preparing for quarter four Christmas sales for a good few months. I've been targeting a lot of my books around gifts, so I'd actually been preparing for quite a while. Now if we actually keep going down we can see day there where well, I did 111 and then it shot all the way down to zero. Nothing on Christmas day because nothing actually gets shipped. Let's just scroll down the page a little bit more. Nothing actually gets shipped so there was nothing at all there. And then after Christmas just a couple of days where I was where I was selling just a few books. So if we actually go here to units and take a look. So throughout the month, I was selling way over 100 units a day. Best day, I sold 318 units. And then my lowest day before Christmas was here, which I sold 143 units. And then after Christmas, we can see I was only selling a handful. So in fact, let's go all the way down to here. We'll stop just there. We can see that 67% of my income or my royalties, my books sold, came from Amazon.com. 29% from here in the UK. 26 from here in Canada. And then the rest on a few other marketplaces. And there's that 870, not 800, $8,770 earned. And I sold 
4,900 units. Now, what's absolutely crazy is I've actually now sold over 18,000 units of my books. So now there's actually 18,000 books that I created out there in the world. And that just completely blows my mind. So let's take a look at a few of these. So this was my best selling book and I sold 1,924 and that actually made me 2,000 two hundred and seventy four dollars now this this is one of my low content books for kids and it was aimed at the christmas niche so this was a kids low content book for christmas that's why it did extremely well now if you want to know exactly how i create my kids books i do cover that within my kids course my kids course you can buy separate it's kids lcb or you can actually purchase the LCB Vault because it's in there as a bonus. Now, my second best selling book for Christmas time was this one. So I sold 647 units, did $1,769, and that is one of my best performing books of all time. If you've been watching any of my videos then you'll know what it is. It is in fact a guest book. Now I'm not going to share what niche within that guest book niche it is but that is my best selling book to date and then these two here are another two kids low content books which did extremely well i sold 618 units of this one made 1421 dollars and then this one i sold 365 and did 481 dollars then this one, this one is actually still selling at the minute. It's selling most days. Not a lot, but it's selling one or two a day, I think. And this is actually for teacher appreciation. So I sold 132 units of this one. I made $204. And let's do one more. I have actually sold 66 units of this one and made $125 with that. Now, if we actually scroll down, you're going to see all the other books that I've sold or that I was selling over Christmas. So I was selling 31 of that one, 25, 20, 17. And then if we go all the way down to here, we can see 6, 8, 4, 4, 5, 2, and all these little payments of six dollars and twenty all added up now quite a lot of these books not all of them but quite a few of them are aimed at gifts so that could be teacher gifts dietitian gifts nurse gifts so i created a lot of notebooks and targeted those types of keywords and it did extremely well for me over Christmas time. See, as we can see here, all these ones mainly sold one, and I could just keep on going down. As you can see, quite a few of books that just sold the one copy. So let's scroll all the way back up to the top like that, and let's go over to my ads accounts and deduct my ad spend from my royalties earned so that we can actually see my true profit. So straight away we're on amazon.com ads account and we can see let's filter this down to december so december 1st i sold not i sold i spent 238 dollars and 99 cents and made 1479 in sales that's not royalties it's like when you see this this is not royalties that is just sales that you made through your ad spend but i spent the 238 dollars and 99 cents on the uk i didn't spend as much or maybe i did so i spent 322 dollars and no 322 pound and 29p and that resulted in 1410 pound in sales so if we take that 322 and 29 go put that into a converter just so we can get a rough estimate that's 418 dollars spent just here in the uk in december so let's take these numbers 
So that is 23899. So 238 pound 99 or dollars. Add that 418. 418 cents. Not cents. I'm getting that wrong again. 418 pound and seven cents equals six hundred and fifty seven dollars and six cents so that's how much i actually spent on my ad spend over christmas time so now if we take this deduct it from my royalties we can see how much i actually earned so eight seven two no let's go back one eight seven two oh three four take away that ad spend which was 657 and six cents roughly so i made over eight thousand dollars in royalties profit which will be coming to my bank at the end of this month because remember that two month delay now these results aren't typical i am going to say that as well now, and again, that this month, December, where I made over $8,000, was my best month ever with publishing low and no content books. And it all comes down to this. So no matter what business that you are in, it all comes down to treating your business like a real business. What happens is, your income will be in direct proportion to how much effort and time you put into running your business. If you don't put much effort in and you treat it like a hobby, you're not going to make much money. See, with me, KDP Publishing, this low content books and no content books, I pretty much, I'm in this business near enough every single day and i'm always learning and always trying to improve that's how you get good results now i hope you enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up also go hit subscribe and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified for any further videos that being said i've been paddy this has been stacking profit and i'll see you again soon